this could have really gone either way, but the adaptation just came at game number three, which you're already two games behind. It's, it's just too little too late, unfortunately. And yeah, bruh, wasting no time joining the arena immediately. I like it. Someone being a bit antsy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he, he wants to scrap. He wants to fight. Um, he doesn't main choke, right? Because he's really feeling it. <laughs> no, he doesn't main choke. Um, previously, we saw, we saw him play um, Falcon against Don Cammy last week. Uh, but he also has a Donkey Kong in the back pocket. Right, he's the walk up and down smash. He's, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 that's him. Yeah, I saw this, this is excellent. Yeah, yeah. and uh, his opponent's gonna be Chansey, which is... Um, actually, Chansey plays a lot of characters, but uh, mostly, from what I recall, Lucina. So I'm kind of guessing we're gonna see Lucina here, but honestly, he could pull out a Violet for all I know. <laughs> but yeah. So, um, uh, yeah, we'll see. Maybe, maybe we'll see some more Falcon Mirrors. Those have always gone off uh, pretty, <laughs> pretty well. I don't think we're going to see a Falcon coming out from Chansey, but what we do see is a lot of Chansey support, uh, which is nice to see. Like, the chat, the chat is, uh, is cheering for Chansey here. But uh, there we go. The Stone Gang going for bruh. <laughs> By the way, um, are you going to be commentating during your set? Is that yes, the... I'm, oh, I'm, just, I'm just gonna invite Beer to have a chat while we play the best of five random match uh, to finish off the stream. Um, let me cool. see what Mitten said. So Arex was using flip jumps to stuff the egg tosses and get futsal off it. It's a strong kind of play to match the offstage Yoshi and can be done on reaction as well. Yeah, that's what we saw him end game number three with, right? No, that was a very nice way to close it out. Yeah. So the, the chat kind of exploding for Bruh and Chansey here. Very nice. And uh, Kana, TCT gang, thank you for the resub. This is, is this a copper gang versus stone gang? Thing? Yes, or... this is actually a copper versus stone gang thing. The stakes have never been higher. <laughs> well, the stakes are going to be even higher this Sunday when we're going to do a crew battle between the two. So that's definitely, you know, if you're enjoying this, definitely tune in Sunday, same time. It's going to be great. Uh, it's the, the, I, I'm expecting the chat to just go during the entire stream, right? Just cheering on each other. Um, all of the stoners and all of the coppers. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That was all this time. Exactly. So let me get the leaderboard, uh, sorry, the scoreboard uh, on its way. So we're actually seeing a Bylet and a Ganondorf. That shows what I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, well, you did say you could pull out the, the yep. Bylet for all you know. Yep. And I, I was right in that. So this is promo to silver, if I am correct. So let's get it. So I've never seen Bros Ganondorf before. Let me be honest here. So this wow. is definitely a surprise for me. It's basically Falcon with his sword, right? And the sword <laughs> just weighs him down. Oh yeah, makes sense. Oh, that's why he's slow. Gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Oh, bro, going Ooh. for it all there. Having the re uh, trying to get the reads on deck at the very least. Um, so this is definitely a weird matchup. Both characters very slow, and uh, Chansey would like to, you know, abuse that little bit of uh, disjoint that he does have to his disposal against Bruh. Trying to go for some uh, nice little mix-ups there off stage, but Bruh just powering through everything with a down B and SD. Yeah, yeah, happens. Happens to the best of us. Unlucky, unlucky. Oh, he's really going for the the call out smashes. <laughs> yep. Well, uh, not working out so far. Trying to get the the roll reads in. And once again, tried to go for a roll read. This man just uh, putting all of his eggs in one basket. Whoa! Once again, what is he doing? I mean, one of these times is gonna work, and it's gonna be amazing when it does. <laughs> the no mix of mix of boy well, almost lost to stock very early to that down smash. Barely got away with it. This is not the bra I'm used to seeing, to be honest. Uh, yeah, I think he needs something a bit faster next game, because this looks a bit... Yeah, iffy. indeed. It does. Wow, that makes it... Oh, Jesus. That that tether, tether is, is uh, insane. Yeah, but, uh... Bruh. He's giving a show. Yep. Trying to find his way back into this game, but, uh... Chansey just playing this, uh... Rather well so far, and just abusing the fact that Bruh is going for a little bit of crazy options. Yeah, he, he, it looks like he's trying to... Oh, <laughs> that was... <laughs> going for it all. Fully charged. Right? These two are just here to play. And with play, I mean just press the big buttons. <laughs> I mean, I think Chansey's got the read on he's gonna try and 
catch my landing on him mm -hmm. with, an, with a smash. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Down throw F smash with Ganondorf. That is the craziest read of the century. But what if it works though? <laughs> yeah. What if it works though? Going deep. Yeah. I can imagine that Chansey wanted the up B, uh, the cool spike. Mm hmm. Right, let's see here. Just trying to find this final good blow to get Bruh stock okay. off. Because you don't want to be last stock against Ganondorf. No. And that's what we're going to see. <laughs> Fully raged. Man, the, I mean, the curses have been on point. It's basically even, right? <laughs> sort of. <laughs> yeah, sort of. Uh, okay, the, the snipe's not working out here. Bruh. It's just a few good reads away from winning this. Downer? That, oh! Oh, that, okay. Both of them trying to downer each other after one another. <gasps> okay. Oh my god, what is happening here? The spaghetti is everywhere. They have knocked the spaghetti off the table. The dog is currently eating it off the floor. This is just, uh... Yeah. I, I'm not really sure what to think of this. Byleth doesn't have a kill throw, I'm pretty sure. Nope. So bro gonna live. Didn't go for the dash attack, which would have taken the stock, I'm pretty sure. What is going on here? Arrow. Oh my lord. Going deep. Don't oh, choke this, Chansey. Nope. Don't choke. Oh my, he went oh, for the what? jump read. He went for everything right there. How is he still alive? <laughs> he has no business. <laughs> he has no business still being alive. I'm not... What's going on here? Why is he grabbing him every time? What? Nope, 230%. Oh! oh my god. How does the game end like that? Oh my god. <laughs> Such overkill, that's ridiculous. He was a 200 and he just, oh why? What was that? <laughs> yeah, yeah I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure that'll kill at 240%. <laughs> what the hell? Well, that was definitely an interesting game. Uh, Gloom Milkshake, thank you for the follow. That, I feel like that's what these players have been drinking. <laughs> oh, man. And <laughs> yeah. What a interesting match. That's definitely... I'm, I'm, I'm expecting the switches. Oh, yeah. We're, we're, both of them are switching. We're going to see the Corin from Chansey. Um, and the Falcon from Bra. So I'm definitely more used to seeing the Falcon from Bra. So I'm, I'm thinking the quality of play will like exponentially just grow like Dole coin like two days ago. Just poof. To the moon. <laughs> to the moon, exactly. <laughs> yeah, um, this has been uh, a very interesting set so far. One doge is one doge. Yeah, uh, it's gonna be. Is it gonna be male corn or is it gonna be female corn? It's always a hot topic for. Uh... Indeed. All right. Oh, oh, the only proper choice according to many players, uh, a vocal <laughs> majority. Yeah. All right. So, bro, with the signature falcon, and here we go, Chansey with the corn, um, which I believe. Yeah, he also plays. He, I think he plays a lot of the Fire Emblem characters actually. Now that I think about it. And back to Kalos. Fire Emblem main. Yeah, Fire Emblem main, exactly. And Bro definitely is one of those players who has the um, instant diligence combos on point most of the time. Surprised we didn't see it there, but you can definitely expect that during this set if he stays Falcon. Cool. I'm not really familiar with uh, those paths that Falcon has with the instant diligence. Oh, it, it allows to some nasty true combos into knees. Like, it, it's very Ooh. scary stuff. Um, true combos into knees sounds. Cool. But who that needs true not... combos if you just drop their like drop knee their shield? Oh my god! <laughs> not sure how that worked. And just weaving past the hitboxes from Chansey. This is uh, yeah, not looking too um like just a bit of a bit of a scrap actually. Oh again, oh. again, the raw knee. That was. He's really going for them. <laughs> yeah, and it's working out. It's working out very good. I mean, very well, I should say. I mean, th this is the bro that I remember, right? Uh, during the very first Snow stream, he showed up with that DK, surprised us all by going for the strangest but hypest options, and you know, still just going for the the hard read stuff. It is bro, and he, he knows what the fans want to see. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay would be upset. Yeah, that that stuff is raw. 
Oh, the pin gonna get... Okay, that was weird. Yeah, one into pin? Yeah. Was it got intercepted once and then Chansey just did it instantly again and then it worked. It was a very strange interaction. Um, but yeah, so far, these two players just scrapping. Bra barely surviving there by the skin of his teeth. Not the greatest DI. Um, but managing to hold on. Pins are working out quite well for Chansey, though. Uh, generally. Mm -hmm. Oh! Ooh, nice he even had a chance to tech there, I'm pretty sure. But, uh... No Who expects that. Yeah, though? nobody expects that, let's be honest. Oh, and uh, oh, once again, was... not the greatest DI on that pin kick. <laughs> I think Bra is just holding in. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't matter, it's just, he's just holding in. Very true. I think that is basically, like, his life motto. <laughs> what is a man but a falcon holding in? <laughs> there is only Ooh, in the eye. in the journey. I was really okay. That's still gonna be it. I was really expecting him to just go for the YOLO a B off stage there. Like I'm not lying. I, I really thought that was gonna happen. It would have been hype, but maybe just a little yeah. bit too risky for him. Cause I mean, mm -hmm. it is of course his uh, his promotion match. Oh yeah, so. for sure. I I can definitely understand that he didn't want to go for that. Uh, in Ome, so there's not a challenge. There's not a Smash GG either. Um, what Snow is, it's an online league. That we have a separate Discord server for it. It's for Dutch players only, though, so that that might be a little bit rough if you're not from the Netherlands. Um, but yeah, so we don't play with a bracket. Instead, players are divided into separate pools, which we call divisions. And uh, there's ten players per division. They're ranked based on basically what we expect their skill to be, and they can promote. So these are the promotion matches, which happen at the end of the season. So yeah, very interesting. Uh, a uh, few sets, of course, because this is basically what the players have been working towards during the entire season. Um, and Kana's and, uh, question, are we going to be able to have unranked league matches on stream? I, I do want to do that. Not entirely sure how I'm going to make that happen, because I'm only a man with limited amounts <laughs> of time. But I, I'm going to try and make it work. All right. I'm sure that if, uh, if you ask nicely, there's other people like LCD Probably. who already does. Probably, yeah. But, uh, alright, let's get into game number three. So, we see the Lucina this time around, which is, I think, Chansey's best character from what I've seen. So, uh, nice to see that one finally turning up here after losing a game. <laughs> Ooh, that was nice. Yeah, great catch yeah, there, yeah. and that is just going to be it. Chansey showing that once, yeah, once the Lucina has come out to play, um, there is not a lot of playroom left for Bro. <laughs> You'd think that maybe he'd have to like warm up as Lucina, but it seems to be raging. Yeah, just uh, you know, character he is most used to playing probably. Oh, bro, just these overextensions get, getting caught yep. every single time, and that is just Chansey calling him out, saying, "All right, no, like I know you like to hold in and, and be aggressive, but sometimes you need to chill." Uh, <laughs> And uh, it's and working. Yeah, he's punished him twice and killed him twice with it. Oh, is this gonna be it? No. All right, back around the shield. Gonna catch the tech with the side B. Chancy, poised to take this game number three here. <laughs> this guy plays like nothing bad ever happened to him, right? We saw those first two games, which are like such weird games full of spaghetti-ish moments, and now this we've seen just looking solid against Bra. No sweat. Yeah, Kana, all of the Fire Emblem characters are obviously the same. They're all Marth, all nine of them. <laughs> yeah, exactly. No need to distinguish between them at all. Oh, no bro, once again, so cool. aggressive. Would have, should have just gone to the center of the stage, in my opinion. Or get the ledge trap going. But here we go. Get something going. Gonna go for the dare on the uh, B. But that's really tough to get against an invincible move like nice that. Jump. Oh yeah, that'll do. Yeah, this. and Jesus. once again, Bra is just getting punished consistently for being too aggressive. He really needs to chill a little bit because it's not working against Chansey at all. Yeah. He's really. It seems like he just got the number on him during his Corin game, and now he's just mm -hmm. abusing it with Lucina. Yeah. Or she, or they, I don't know. Yeah, uh, it's a he, I'm pretty sure. I'm okay. pretty sure Chansey is a he. It's kind of confusing because Chansey, the Pokemon, yeah. is kind yeah, of exactly. feminine it's in a weird... way. Yeah. And uh, I, I can't say uh, Chansey's Twitch name, but it, it's definitely... It, it's not PG-13, but it's it's feminine, so to say. <laughs> um, mm -hmm. So yeah, it's kind of interesting. Uh, Nova, alright Lars, you were right with me. Wanting to slap myself on the face after that set. Holy, I had some terrible moments in that. 
I, I, th thought I think so. we both had some terrible moments, but I wouldn't make it too hard on yourself. Yeah, it's you know, it's very tough to see that sort of stuff while you're playing, right? And that's mm -hmm. that's why you're here to, you know, experience stress Ooh. and Lilat. and go to Lilat apparently. <laughs> I love Lilat. You love Lilat? All right. Yeah. All right. That that should tell me that uh, I I should never you know leave Lilat open against you. I'm terrible. Because <laughs> I, I, oh. yeah. I do not like Lila. But in any case, stage preference aside, Stu have been going at it during the first talk. I'm just playing a little bit. Nothing too crazy has happened just yet. Brub being very aggressive once again. And this time working out though. That is a wow. And that is what I mean. So, what he did there was a side B into the instant double jump knee, which can be a true combo. And that is what we saw there. So. Yeah, bro. As I said, having those on point. I was I was gonna say that I was surprised that uh, bro would counterpick Lilet, but it seems to be working out for him quite well. <laughs> yeah. Oh, <no>, again! <laughs> I told you he has them on point. I told you. What a reversal from that previous game. Now it's bro being up two full stocks against Chansey. Gonna even it up though. But wow, what a start for bro there. Okay, gets a back air there. Down air grab, up air, no up air. But Chansey just looking overwhelmed here this time around, you know? That really can just be a Falcon thing. Sometimes you just get hit with all of the hits and you just lose the games. Okay, wow, what a <laughs> sequence up air, up B. Strange, but working out. I'm not sure if seriously still here, because I don't hear him. Um, Oh, he doesn't hear me anymore? That is interesting. You guys still hear me. Alright, I'm just gonna commentate the match, and the match is over. <laughs> what is that timing? What is that timing? <laughs> oh, I thought I'd turn it off and on again. And oh, it works now? Reach screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, okay. I rejoined the call. Alright, fantastic. But, um, did, what, did he did he knee him again in the same way, or what happened? Honestly, like I was kind of distracted because I was trying to figure out what was happening with you, and I I was like, all right, I'm let sorry. me <laughs> let me commentate the game, and as soon as I said that, it just it was over. And um, sorry, <laughs> don't count me being a bit too overzealous there, because this is a game five, so I'm gonna kick him. Get out, get he, out of here! Oh, he left. He changed he left. his tag to Bass Fan One. Yeah, <laughs> he did. <laughs> Yeah, let me commentate the game. <laughs> that was a perfect slapstick timing. Like if that could have been a Monty Python sketch. <laughs> but yeah, so let me actually look back at the uh, thing here. So we're gonna go to FD. Uh, it's gonna be the the final uh, game is gonna be played there, and I think they're just sticking with their characters, which is nice because this has been very interesting. They both just blew each other up during these two games so yeah it's it's quite insane because as soon as Brog gets in he really gets in oh but yeah we're gonna have to see if Chansey can uh use a sword to just no don't don't <laughs> touch me please go away yeah just try to keep him out of her range right out of her zone uh, bro gonna power through there instant double jump up there not leading to anything because of the bit of a wacky Ooh. situation wow. all right so a uh, pretty okay start for both players just nothing too crazy at the moment but I said that during the previous game as well and look how that ended <laughs> so all right <laughs> these, wow that knee these knees on shield man he's just been going for them I'm surprised that one hit to be fair. <laughs> yeah it was he like turned with his back to him mm -hmm. reverse and all all right, Chansey with the patience, shielding there. Very nice. And this, he really likes yeah. the down airs, trying to catch uh, a jump up. Mm -hmm. I really think that Chansey overall is like um, this is basically a, a match of defensive versus offense, and it's it's looking like Bruce's offense is a bit too clean for Chansey's defense. Um, but then again, you know, any, anything can happen. This is only just the first stock here. So let's see. I hope Shook oh, hydrated because I spent all my points on it. I did, I did. I'm gonna grab more water in a sec. Oh no! Oh, that's... Wow. That is a way to lose a stock at zero. Um, oh, that must feel really bad for Chansey. God. I hope that he can compose himself. 
Yeah, bro just looking to take this all the way. He is just storming through all of the stocks and uh, is <laughs> running over him now. Yeah, Chansey yeah. getting hit back. Every single side B not knowing what to do. FD not working out because there's no platforms to land. Uh, gets the stage bike okay. though. Nice. What? Nice. That is what he needed to get back into this game. So let's see if he can make it count. He had a nice percent, so that makes sense. <laughs> he really did though. Uh, yeah, he did. Once again, okay, the down smash working out, trying to catch a roll. Instead, just whiff punishing. Bro, using movement to the utmost here, just trying to mix Chansey up so much. Chansey not having any of it though. Chansey go. Oh, that one was really close to being um, over. Yeah, what looked like a solid bro game is now just a very tense game five. This can go either way in the blink of an eye. Let's see who can clutch it out here. So Chansey gets the grab, throws him off stage. I feel like Bra is gonna go for the flashy because he goes for flashy and maybe Chan oh. oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> he does go for flashy. That is very, very true. And Bra gonna take it three to one. So the Falcon switch working out very well from here. And that is going to be that. So uh... Bra gives. It's it's fun to watch his uh, his games. It's, they're very exciting. <laughs> he just yeah. yeah. He just goes ham, dude. That, there's one thing that he does, and it is to go ham. <laughs> he is a big consumer of pork. <laughs> exactly. So I'm actually gonna re refill real real quick. So 